Oh, what a wonderful, restful nap I just had. Oh, glorious. Oh, oh man, that's a little creepy. <laughs> Welcome back, Cthulhu crew, to some more Gang Z Rust. R Rust Z? Gr Grust? I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what I want to call it. Probably just going to be Gang Z Rust for the time being. Looks like, oh sweet, sun is rising. Oh, beautiful. We have so much time. Now, I have gotten a few tips from you guys, like I asked. Thank you very much for that. Uh, one tip that I want to try out first and foremost is using the map. So, if I have it here and I hit G, oh, I hold down G. Now, do I have to have it highlighted? I don't have to have it highlighted. Okay, does it even have to be on my hotbar at all? Let's find out. It does. That's kind of weird. So it has to be on the hotbar, but you don't actually have to have it selected in the hotbar. But I can hold G, and then how do I... Okay, I like right-clicked and it freed up my mouse. And I can click and drag around. And then it looks like I can do stuff somehow. <laughs> Okay, I can scroll. Okay, cool. So I am at the train yard. Oh man, I am pretty far south. Oh, cool. Okay, so things are labeled. Um, I noticed in our Discord chat that the OPB is set up north of the dome. That's the only info I have heard. Um, I think that was actually where I was checking out before. I don't think where I was at was at a satellite dish, so I might head back that way. And now that I actually have a map, I can I can figure out you know where to go, how to do things, and that sort of thing. Um, do I? Okay, I do have a little bit of an arrow of which way I want to go. So I do want to go this general direction. So thank you very much for those of you who gave me that tip about the map. Speaking of tips, nobody told me that I could bash barrels and get stuff out of all of you commenters. Not a single solitary soul thought fit to inform me about bashing barrels. You guys suck. What do I keep you guys around for if not to help me? My gosh, I would have thought that one of you at least would have had the decency to clue me in on that. But good gravy, apparently I was wrong. Um, Sarcasm, FYI, for those of you who are completely lost right now. <laughs> a little, little bit of sarcasm there. Um, I'm so full of stuff. I don't, at this point, I don't know what's valuable, valuable, <laughs> what's valuable and what's not, honestly. I'm using lots of different crafting recipes. Okay, I'll keep that then. Some people are saying the spring might be used for weapons, used to provide motion or resistance in objects. Ah, oh, leather... There's so much of this stuff that's probably worth keeping around, you know? Let's eat a little... Oh, that was raw pork. Whoops. <laughs> Did I eat all my cooked pork already? I must have. Whoops. Um, there's a sewing kit here. I'm gonna take that because I don't know if it's useful or not. As far as I can, I'm just going to hold stuff until I come across stuff that seems more interesting, and then I'll have to make some decisions and whatnot. Smack. Get smacked. I, I rocked that stone so good. <laughs> um, so let's see. Other tips. What else did you guys let me in on? Uh, oh, apparently I can hit Q to go straight to crafting, instead of going, you know, tab and then going to crafting. That's kind of nice, so Q straight up. I like that. Um, what does it take to make a campfire? A ton of wood, wow. Uh, let's go ahead and do that real quick. I'll get that cooking because I do have two two food stuffs that I can cook up, two types of food. So we'll do a little bit of that action. And I think the order uh, for today is going to just be to uh, to head kind of back the way I came. Oh, 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 I've heard about this as well, that helicopters are bad. Oh gosh, is this going to wreck me? I need to get into a building, but I've gone the wrong way. So apparently that's just some kind of... Oh gosh, oh it's coming to me. Can I... Oh gosh, can I get to the building? Is it going to gun me down like a dog? Please no. Get into the building. Run, CT, run. 
Oh gosh. So apparently that's some kind of autonomous thing that just exists in the game and from what I gather it will kill you or something like that. I don't know. I'm guessing you can probably shoot it down and get stuff, but that's just completely a guess at this point. That is the first time I have seen one of those helicopters, thankfully. I'm going to I'm going to go all the way up here. Maybe the helicopter will leave. I want to see if there's anything going on up in this tower. Okay, there's a shoot. Is this like a grain tower? This is dumb and boring. <laughs> there's nothing up here. Also, you go upstairs very slowly. Looks like I'm moving down them just fine. But my goodness, the uppiness was... Oof, like who takes ta who takes stairs that slowly, really, though? Um, Alright, so we have the fire... Let's get that action going, and man, this thing is so picky about where it gets placed. Is the chopper gone? I'd really rather not get chopped if I can help it. So here's another thing I would love to hear from you guys: is what, what kind of conditions is this fireplace looking for in order to be placed? Like, is that how is this not a valid spot to put a freaking fireplace? Seriously, though, that's so weird to me. Like, it literally could not be more open around here. <laughs> what the heck? I can't remember what type of area I was in where I got the dang thing to place before. Am I going to be able to get across without getting soaked? Oh, man. I got... I'm drying off as I'm swimming, but the second I touch the water, it's like, oh, you're 80% wet now. Dang. Uh, so, I would love a tip about... I don't think I can bash those. I would love a tip about the, the fireplace. Why can't I... Oh, okay, I can place it in the middle of the road. Perfect. Is that something moving over there? Or is that just a bush? I wasn't sure if that was like a vehicle coming across the way or not. Um, foodstuffs. So, yeah. How do I, how do I get... A fireplace to place more easily. Is there any like hidden stuff I, can, I should know about that? And and also, what else was I trying to think of? <laughs> I completely lost what the other thing I was trying to ask for was. Gosh darn it! All right, never mind. <laughs> It'll come back to me eventually, I'm sure. Um. Oh, I can make leather gloves. But it seems like... Oh, take it? Oh yeah, right click. I want to take it before it burns this time. Um, it seems like this radiation suit kind of takes all of the space for clothing. Which I'm sure probably isn't ideal, but it seems like it has numbers next to pictures, which I would assume is a decent thing. I don't know if charcoal's any use. I'm going to drop that. Uh, if y'all want to cook sometime today, that'd be cool. Yeah, so as we're as we're backtracking a little bit, trying to get to where I think the OPB might be set up, um, I'm definitely going to start bashing barrels. Now, I had the impression that you could, because like you look at a barrel and it has a health meter and all that, so it stands to reason you can probably decrease the health of that barrel. But uh, in my defense, like some of those barrels have like radiation symbols on them or nuclear symbols on them or something, so. Logic would say, maybe don't smack that barrel. <laughs> but now I know. Now I know. Oh, crap. What did I just say to do? Build a bomb barricade? I wanted to click it and get more info on it, but apparently I'm gonna... Can I cancel that? Okay, I can. A protective barricade made out of stones. Interesting. So is that like a little quick shelter kind of deal? That's kind of cool. I can get down with that. Get down with the sickness. Let's eat some cooked chicken. I thought this was deer meat or something. What the heck? <laughs> I haven't killed any chickens. So, it was on this very road that we're standing on right now. Um, we saw a deer last time. I shot the deer and I took meat from it. And that meat became um, deer meat. Oh, wait, no, sorry. I said 
I killed a horse. <laughs> I saw a horse. I killed a horse. I got meat from it, and it was raw deer meat. And now that I've cooked it, it's become cooked chicken. <laughs> what kind of black magic meat is this? My gosh. Go figure, man. I don't know. This is freaking me out. And this stuff takes forever to cook. I'm surprised nobody's come by and killed me by now. I don't really know if anybody's playing right now or not. Seriously, though? There we go. My gosh. Okay, I'll turn you off. I'll take the wood back. Um, oh yeah, and also let me know if there's a way to, like, reclaim fire pits. I have no clue. Okay, so now we can bash more barrels! Let the barrel bashing begin! If one of these things kills me when I bash it, I'm gonna be so pissed. Ooh, metal blade. Can I make a, a meat cleaver out of that? That's what it looked like. Another metal blade, I think? Metal blade. Let's take a look at that real quick. A metal blade for making melee weapons. <gasps> cool. Let's see. Weapons. I can make bone stuff. High quality metal. SMG body. Oh, yeah. Metal spring. Look at that. Metal blade. Metal fragments. I need a lot more metal fragments to get a long sword. Oh, man. There's so much stuff to craft in this game, it looks like. Frick. Another helicopter. This is so weird. I either never ran into one before, like my first hour or so of playing, or I just never noticed it. Get out of my life, guy. All right, so I'm probably just going to wander for a little bit. Uh, you guys don't really need to see this because we're going to be backtracking over stuff we've already seen. But uh, I'll bring you guys back in as stuff happens. What the heck? What the heck? What is this? Is this like a little little drop for me? Gosh, I have too much stuff. Um, is it horrible to get rid of my starting rock? Uh, bone club, I can drop you. And take the chocolate bar. I'll just eat the chocolate bar outright. That's interesting. Was that like a little... little airdrop present for me? It wasn't super great, but it's better than nothing. Strange. All right, barrel bashing and walking north. All righty, we are back here at the dome. And I remembered what the other thing I was hoping you guys could fill me in on was. <laughs> what it was. Um, is there a way to go into third person so I can, like, see myself? That would be, be kind of nice every once in a while. I want to see how I look and all that, you know? So if that is a thing, if there's some kind of key I can press for that... Oh, sheet metal. Uh, then let me know. Um, I found a pickaxe at one point. Oh, gosh. I hear a chocolate. Could you not? How, how bad is this right now? Is this bad? Are you going to leave me be? I'm trying to sort my inventory, guy. <laughs> Um, gosh, like, all the stuff I have feels semi-important. You know what? I don't care for the hat, because then it, uh, it makes me take off my entire suit. So, screw that. This chopper has it out for me, you guys. It's just ghosting me this whole time. Let's go under the... They call this the dome, but this is a full-on sphere. Why call this a dome? I don't get that at all. Let's bash some barrels in. Oh, this... Okay, low-grade fuel. This is definitely causing durability damage on my weapon, which makes sense. I wasn't really paying attention to that previously. Crude oil, low-grade fuel. Man, you guys weren't kidding about... I mean, I wish some of you had told me that there's good stuff in these barrels. A bunch of scumbags don't clue me in on things. I don't have space for the crude oil but I am able to stack the low-grade fuel, so I'm gonna leave the oil behind, because I have I have so many inventory woes already. <laughs> I'll just take what I can get. Um, so, we're heading north now. North of the dome slash sphere. I mean, that's, that's totally not just a dome. Ha the top half of that would be a dome, but there's also a bottom half, so go figure. I don't know. Give me what you got. Metal blade, sure. You stack with what I'm already holding, so we'll we'll go with that. So, man, 
Where did I start from? I must have started from like along the shore over here or something. So I must have started pretty close to where people were set up and I must just not have actually seen it, which is kind of sad. But hey, what you gonna do? Can I chop you for wood? Not with this, I can't. Oh, hey. Holy butts. <laughs> this looks like an installation of some sort. Wow. There's a whole freaking village here already. And I'm just like, herp the derp. I know I can smack, <laughs> smack barrels now. <laughs> herp the derp. Wow. Wee. I'll take some hemp. Sure. So what's going on up in here? Dang. What the, what the crap? I'm assuming that this is made by my peoples. Fuel storage. Can I store you there? Sure can. There you go. I'm contributing. I am a contributing member. Oh, look at me go. Okay, let's let's get the lay of the land here. Those of you who are subscribed to other OPB members probably already know what's going on here in the base, but this is my first time seeing it. <laughs> little picnic chair. Oh man, some kind of kiln kind of thing? Large furnace? Is this where I can smelt stuff? Uh, this is stone. This is metal ore. You can extract this metal using a furnace. Let's try putting some of that in there. I'm just curious, because we came across some kind of furnace-y thing before, and it didn't seem to really do anything. So I'm going to let that go for a little bit. I'm really curious if that's actually going to do anything with my metal. But man, look at this place! Uh, oh. Oh no, can I not even get in? It's all keypad stuff? Unlock with code? Knock. <laughs> I don't know the code! This is my base, right? My, my team's base? My goodness. Have you... Hey, 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 you have done a thing! Metal fragments. Okay, I'm gonna let you sit there. Uh, although the wood... Let's take some of that wood back, because I'm gonna need to practice... Um, building and stuff like that, but I kind of want to just let that go. I'm sure there are other materials that are more efficient to be used, but, uh, what the heck? But I'm going to let that wood sit there. Is this a turret? Oh, it's a light in the direction of the light. It has storage? Interesting. Wow, there's so many things in this game that I have to learn about. This is crazy. Hey, I just met you, and this is crazy. No, I'm not. I'm not going there. I'm not going there. I kind of already did, but I'm not anymore. <laughs> okay, more sewing kit. Uh, see, look at this. Why would you see that symbol on a barrel and think, "Hey, I should smack that barrel"? You know what? That's oh gosh! It just freaking melted everything down. What? See, this is why you don't just smack barrels, kids. What the heck? That was freaky! Okay, moving on. Moving right on along. <laughs> what is all this stuff? Okay, apparently everything is locked down. What the crap? So I'm not going to be able to actually do anything. Uh, filling and unfilling. Select an appropriate container and container. What the heck? Okay. Well, at least get a lay of the land here and see what all is going on. My goodness, so much stuff that I'm just... I'm overwhelmed. There's so much coolness going on. I need to practice building, too. There's a lot of different building materials by the look of it. Is this not, like, the same... Did I walk through this uh, field before or not? I don't know. I, I It feels similar to stuff I've seen before, but... Who really knows? Honestly. Oh, okay, don't smack you. <laughs> uh, are you more corrugated? You are. Cool, I'll take you. Alright. I like stuff that combines, that stacks. And I'm assuming stuff like this is player built. Like this is some kind of machinery that you can build, because it looks exactly like the one that I dropped some fuel in. Wow! 
Cray cray. There's a lot of stuff going on here. Well, I think maybe the next point of business... Are you going to get all freaky on me? Okay, no freaky deaky yet. What was up with that other one? The next point of business might be to try my hand at building just to see like how it works. I don't expect to really get anything done. The cage. <laughs> I don't expect to get anything done, but I, I just want to do some science and learn how stuff happens. Oh, I think I noticed um, Gentleman James was talking about this. Like He made this so if we capture any LCM people to uh, put them in the cage and make them fight to the death. I like it. I hope I didn't just spoil anything that he hasn't shown off already. Oh, are these like rain collectors? Nice! Alright, so I'm gonna have to go and chat with my my teammates and find out how I can actually access the doors, what the key code is and all that jazz. Um, <laughs> but that'll be, that'll be a time for another day. We've at least found stuff here. And let's open you up. Okay, so everything, all my fuel has gone kaput. That's fine. I got 20 more pieces of metal. Oh, wooden barricades. Oh, boxes. I need boxes, but uh, I don't have anywhere safe to put them yet because I can't get into a building. Ah. All right, well, this over here is relatively open still. Can I get wood with you? Do I have to use this rock to gather wood currently? Or does this this large downed tree just not bequeath its wood unto me? That's kind of sad. Well, I have a little bit of wood already. <clears throat> uh, let's go to build? Wooden door. I thought I had to have a like a hammer or something like that. I thought I saw, yeah. So it takes wood. That takes a lot of wood. Use to upgrade building materials, right click for the option. So maybe I don't need that just yet? I don't know. Um, let's just, hello? Let's just goof around with some basic stuff. Hatch, what kind of flooring is there? Like I want a foundation or a floor. A floor grill. There's got to be more flooring than just that, right? I see I can make a door. And a shop front. Wood shutters. Like, there's a lot of cool stuff. What kind of... What does this kind of stuff take? Stones. <gasps> That's a lot of wood. What? <laughs> Lots of metal fragments. Oh, this is... This stuff is grindy as crap, man. Wow. Okay, well maybe we do need to start with that hammer, so let's let's go with that. So we'll craft you up slowly but surely. And I think I just I have to have a box of some sort. I have to. Oh, now I've used up wood, so I don't have enough. Uh stores up to 12 items it's going to take what little bit of wood I have left, but I, even if my stuff isn't going to be secure, I have to, have to, have to start storing things. Um, and of course I am full. Let's drop... Uh, what's going to be the easiest to find again? I guess this thing. I wonder how long stuff lasts before it despawns. So what happened to the thing I crafted? My hammer. Oh! Oh, I think I saw it somewhere. There it is. Gosh, that sucks. <laughs> okay, so I'm looking at the hammer. Uh, there's my wooden box. Let's drop... Let's drop the pickaxe for just a second. Oh, that's going to be just as hard to find. Dang it. Never mind. All right, so now we'll get this box. Pop you down. Thankfully, that at least let me uh, put stuff... Or put it down without too much of a hassle. Um, okay, let's just start storing random things that I'm probably not going to have stacking for me just yet. I need to get some wood so I can do lots of building. And I think that'll be a good start. Okay, hammer, pickaxe, glorious. And then we'll pick the large med kit up again. And still a little bit full, but uh, it's, it's better. It is better. 
I don't need the map on the hot bar just right now. And we'll try getting the pickaxe out as well. So if I have the hammer, it said something about right click or it upgrades stuff. I can swing with it. What happens if I hit this? <laughs> Get upgraded. <laughs> okay, so that's that's not doing it for me. Hmm. Alrighty, guys. I chopped down a few trees away from, from base here just so I wouldn't deforest things too much. I have no idea how long it takes for resources to respawn. If they do at all, we shall see. Hello. Hiya! Wait, seriously? Hold on. A pickaxe, useful for gathering ore from rocks. Do I have to right... What the heck? If I hold down right click... Wait, what? <laughs> okay, so apparently I can hold down right click and then left click to chuck my item? <laughs> Where'd it go? It's gone forever. Wow. <laughs> Today I learned amazing. <laughs> I also learned that uh, this current club that I'm holding is terrible for gathering wood. And this one was much better. Did I not get anything from this one? Freaking cheapskate. Wow. All right then. Oh, propane tank. It's empty, but it's kind of interesting. And... Wait, is this... Oh, weird! Okay, this is my storage box, but this all popped up right next to it. Because it, that was not here a second ago. Weird! Okay, so this kind of stuff just pops up willy-nilly. Interesting! Alright, alright. Let's grab us some crude oil. Huh! <laughs> Learned yet another thing. Oh gosh, and there it goes! Freaky. Um, all right, let's dump the propane over there and the propane accessories. Um, I got 2,500 wood. Wow, that actually added up pretty stinking fast. I didn't feel like I was working on it all that long. And I took a really quick look at a wiki just to like learn the basics of building. And apparently I need to make some paper first. And then I make building plans. Something like that, so let's make like five of those, craft them up, and they take a few seconds. If this if this is actually what it takes, I would never, ever, ever would have thought of this on my own. So I can make, yeah, I can make plans. Planter box, hey, there you go. Signpost, planter box, building plans. You can use this to craft buildings. So do you like put the entire building together itself? That's interesting. Hold on. So is it not at all piece by piece? Oh, you have to wait. See, this, this kind of crafting cue stuff annoys me. It's like I've gone through the work of gathering the resources. I've been able to craft the item. Why just wait an arbitrary amount of time that adds nothing to the gameplay experience whatsoever? <laughs> That's a pet peeve of mine in games like these. Uh, oh, I picked up a tarp as well. I wanted to see if there's anything interesting I can make out with a tarp. Um, okay, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I have building plans. <gasps> okay, so here's a building plan. Interesting. If I right-click on you or left-click on you, a building plan, you can use this to craft buildings. Okay, so I don't think I'm going to be stepping on anyone's toes if I just put something randomly here. That ain't no building plan. What the heck? They call a foundation a building plan? Okay, so looking back at the wiki. <laughs> so by default, um, you get this foundation thing. To select other building objects, hold right, m right mouse button and move... Oh, this is kind of how Stranded Deep is starting to go, right? More or less. Steps, floor... Interesting. 
I'm not sure how I feel about this. <laughs> I like that. Floor or ceiling, depending on where you're standing. Interesting. Oh, and we're going to run into issues like with arc. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Phew. Let's just do... Let's just do those two. And so now, if I want to switch to a wall... Hello? Wall. Oh, I have to left click it. Okay. Oh, interesting. Huh. Oh, and then, oh, I see. Now that I have this. Oh, okay. So the building plan doesn't get consumed. See, when I first heard that, I thought, oh, like you come up with your building plan and then you place it all down and it like consumes the resources or something. Um, oh, okay. So you select what kind of thing you want with your building plan and then you can keep using it over and over as long as you have the resources for what you want to build. Okay. Interesting. So now we want a doorway. Oh. And now we want foundation steps, I guess. Is that a thing? Hello? Foundation steps? Oh, sure enough. Oh, it's all coming together. So, these are all just like basic. So do I, I pop, oh, I don't want a sloped one like that. Can I just get floor triangle, floor frame. Can I just get like a straight across the top kind of thing? Wall frame. A hat for your house. Oh, okay, it fills in. Okay, it fills in for you. Interesting. Huh. Look at our beautiful hut. <laughs> it's gorgeous. This is a really... Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Is that... Is that friend or foe? I'm gonna guess it's friend. And shoot them. <laughs> no, I won't. Oh, gosh! Oh, okay, it's foe. It's Chirpa. It's gotta be Chirpa. I'm bleeding. I'm dead. I finally came up with stuff, and now I'm dead. I finally freaking figured stuff out, and now I'm gonna die. Is this an enemy, or is someone just trolling me? What the heck? Okay, build a door. Build a door, quickly. Build a wooden door. Craft it. <laughs> I need to make a bed, too. Because I, I have no idea where I'm going to spawn. Oh, gosh. How do I make a bed? Sleeping bag. Do it. Craft it up. This is not going to end well. <laughs> I'm trapped in my own home. Hey, let's do this. Ah, I was doing science and I was figuring stuff out. I'm pretty sure this is just somebody screwing with me. Boom! Okay. Yes, we're safe. We're safe forever. No, these these things are actually really easy to bot down. I'm pretty sure. Actually, I should get this out because it's a little faster. Can I lock this? No. Uh, I'm scared. I'm pretty sure this is a teammate that's just being a, a jerk bag and screwing with me. Pretty sure. Like, 99.999% sure. But you never know. You just never know. Let's get a sleeping bag down. More options are available. Rename, give to friend, pick up. Huh. My bed. There. Does that, does that do it? Is this now my spawn point? I hope so. So the one thing I wanted to check out that I was just about to is now that I have this hammer and I have this basic stuff set up, do I come up here? Oh gosh, that's freaky looking. Oh yeah. Okay, so now I can rotate, upgrade to wood, upgrade to stone. 
Oh, that's cool. Upgrade to armored. Wow. Let's just do an upgrade to wood. Gosh, that looks freaky as. Interesting. So, hmm. So no matter what you want to build, you have to start with just the really crummy basic stuff. And then you go through and upgrade every piece? That seems kind of annoying to me. Like, I think I would rather just be able to build a stone thing and then place that down, you know? I don't know. It's it's interesting. I've never seen a building system quite like this. Yeah, so that's, that's a little more fortified now. <laughs> a little more, and I'm just about out of wood. But we'll get our little hut a little more fortified. The, I really like the look of the stuff a lot. That's pretty cool. Well, guys, finally managed to do a little bit of building science, and I found the base, and I am... I'm a prisoner in my own little hut. I need to get my storage unit in here, too. Crap. Okay, well, I'm guessing... I'm guessing all these extra building plans are kind of useless, so let's drop these. And they're super cheap to craft up, too. Did not know exactly what I would need with those. Um, yeah, I guess I'm going to try moving my storage in here without getting murdered by whatever random person jerkbag that is outside. Pretty sure that must have just been a teammate screwing with me. Surely. Surely it was. Please don't kill me. Please, whoever you are, do not kill me. Have mercy on my soul. Oh man, night passed already, huh? Okay, sneak back in here. Now I'm curious... Okay, yeah, it looks like stuff doesn't fall through the floor. Because that was, that's been an issue with, with other games like this that I have played. Stuff falling through the dang floor. Um, but it seems like... This is handling it a little bit better. It is kind of dropping stuff in odd places, though, that I wouldn't expect. Drop you. Drop you. I guess it drops stuff where I'm currently looking when I go into my inventory. Oh, gosh! What was that? Something's afoot. I don't care for this whatsoever. Get the stuff in my inventory, quick. Quick, can I pick up this box? Crap, I can't pick up the freaking box! Craptastic, man! Dang it, butts! Stupid! I don't think I can even craft another box, can I? Can I craft a small box? I need freaking hundred wood! Frick face! Oh, I've got this stuff sitting here. Okay, crude oil, med kit, pants. I can live without that stuff. Let's take the med kit back. The metal blades I kind of want to hold on to. I think I can live without these other things. Dang it, but stupid! Ah, it takes so much wood to do anything around here. Hello? Screw this, I'm out of here. I'm out of here, guys. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this episode of a derp noob playing Rust. I'm starting to figure things out. I figured out the building system with a little bit of help from my friend called Wiki. Getting there slowly but surely. Keep those tips coming, guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you again next time.